Hi everybody, my name is Ivica, thank you so much for joining me on my latest Fortnite Creative Beginner tutorial that will show you how you can use the pop-up dialogue device. The same device is pretty useful and interesting when you want to create some kind of message or information system that your players need to have or see and it's really easy to use and apply. So let's see the setup that I made and let's go through some basic characteristics of the same device. Of course, to get it, simply go to your content. Under your devices, you have it here, pop-up dialog device. Creates a pop-up dialog box to show to players informational text and input and output options. What did I do here? Well, I placed one such device and I connected it to two types of light. I have a question at the start, yes or no. The answer to yes turns on the green light. The answer to no turns on the red light. How does it look like? Well, here in the basic options, you have your title, I just sent question. You have the ability to align, the description to add to your players, when to display, type the number of replies or buttons. Here you have more options where you can kind of define each of these buttons, button one, button two. So it's basically yes or no. Yes turns on the green light, turn red, is turned on by no opacity who can activate it regular stuff when it comes to functions you have the ability to show hide enable disable to everyone or some of the players and this is the most important element events you can send events through a range of options on dismissed on timeout button one and button two this is the thing that i have on show we have several more options that we can edit six in total and any button also can send an event. So with that, they're all connected to the customizable light, both of those answers. And let's see how it looks like in the game itself. So I'm entering the match, right? When my game begins, I'll get the pop-up dialogue. And if I say yes, here is the green light. If I end my game and replay it, so play again, I'm back in the same setup the same pop-up dialogue device will appear. I'll get the same question. If I answer no, here is the red light. Very easy, very straightforward, very compact and very, very useful. So hopefully you found this tutorial useful. If you did, please consider supporting me through a range of means. You can check out my Patreon page. You can check out my channel memberships. You can check out my books on Amazon. But of course, the cheapest, easiest, fastest way to support me. Simply subscribe to my channel, become my new sub and be here for my new tutorials. That's all for me. My name is Ivica. Thanks a lot for watching. Thanks a lot for being here until the very end. Have a great day. Have loads of fun in your Fortnite Creative Adventures and I'll talk to you on my new Fortnite Creative tutorial. Until then, bye bye.